Hello, beloveds. Thank you for joining me. My name is Unicole Unicron, and it is my honor to have your attention. Thank you for joining me for my new series, Can This Heal Me? Today, we are going to be talking about what I call my magic necklace, which is actually called the Sensor 5. Of course, I have a Sensor 5 here, and I'm obsessed with this necklace, <laughs> okay? If you look at this picture, you can see that this necklace is designed with these little pyramids and it's really interesting because it's actually curved down it dips down in the middle and the whole design of the uh of the necklace is 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 what makes it so let's talk about it what is the sensor five the sensor five is a brass gold-plated necklace invented by Patrick Flanagan. It says it on the back. And it is simply that. It's a medallion, it's an amulet, and it is, I believe, a high-powered healing device. How does it work? I believe the Sensor 5 works simply with the sacred geometry that it embodies. Um, like I said, it's got a concave center and the actual pyramids um, blast out energy. So it's sort of pulling energy into the center while simultaneously blasting it out. And the first time that I saw the Sensor 5, my friend was wearing it. And okay, let me start here. He told me a story where he was hanging out with a friend and the friend said, oh, where's your Sensor 5? necklace and he said i don't have a sensor five necklace he was aware of dr flanagan's work but he didn't have a necklace and the friend said no you you definitely have one you were wearing it last time i saw you and we had a whole discussion about it and my friend said i wasn't wearing it and they said yes you were and so they had some kind of timeline glitch timeline hop where my friend in another timeline had this necklace talked to their friend and then didn't actually have it and so he took that as a sign to go out and get his own when he told me this story i thought that's kind of weird he's full of wacky stories just like most of my friends right so you just take it with a grain of salt like we're, we're all living in this very strange reality and what can you do you know uh but when i looked at the necklace simply gazing upon it i had like a very psychedelic experience and the way that i saw it is as the physical necklace itself but i also saw into the energetic vibration of what this necklace is doing and i and it's just because of the shape it's just because of this sacred geometry and the materials that uh, that it's designed also the 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 size so when I looked at it the way that I described my experience was like looking at a QR code um, but in real life right like with my own eyes seeing beyond the physical world into the energetic reality and I was very impressed by that and I thought that is truly amazing I have since worn this necklace while traveling and what's interesting is that it's a very large piece, right? And I, I'll usually wear it if I'm wearing all black, I'll have it so it's standing out like very profoundly and I, I sort of set the intention that anyone who sees it and comments on it is star family, right? And surprisingly, um, nobody ever has nobody's ever commented on this necklace which i think is very interesting personally why do i have one though so i saw my friend wearing it and uh like many healing technologies this is not a cheap device like i'm calling it a device because i really do believe it's more than a necklace i think that it is a interdimensional device this is just my experience with it most people would look at this and say it's a necklace uh and some people pay quite a lot of money for necklaces but this particular necklace is between five and six hundred dollars so that's not a cheap necklace it is made out of good materials it's like i said gold plated brass uh but this isn't going to be for everyone right and and what what is this necklace doing 
what is this necklace doing? Uh, I would say that the healing potential with this necklace is that it is a protective mechanism. Like I said, I really feel drawn to wearing it while I'm traveling. These spiky energies like send people's energy back out. I feel like it sort of transmutes energy. I also feel like it's a massive manifester because uh, Dr. Patrick Flanagan also wrote this book called Pyramid Power, which I haven't yet read, but it's full of interesting diagrams such as this one for ratio psychotronic detectors. And I'll tell you a little bit more about Dr. Patrick Flanagan, the inventor of this necklace. So where did it come from? Dr. Patrick Flanagan is this guy and the story goes that he was sleeping one day as a child and he woke up from a dream and he was 12, like that kind of age. And he woke up from this dream and I'm just telling this very <laughs> anecdotally, but the dream was that aliens came to him and they said, hey, Patrick, Humanity's going to die if something doesn't change. And he woke up with the schematics for another technology called the Flanagan's Neurophone, which we'll discuss in another video. But ever since then, he was an inventor and he created different healing technologies, a few different necklaces like this magic necklace and Flanagan's Neurophone, which uh, is a miraculous device in and of itself and he's a very interesting fellow so it came from him <laughs> and i just gotta say i feel like he knows what's going on and this device honestly blows my mind uh skep my skepticism for this device is it's just a necklace but it, this has this makes no claims. It's got no electricity plugged into it. It's it's simply an amulet. It's simply a necklace, and yet my rating for this is five out of five stars. I love this necklace. I don't feel drawn to wearing it every single day. Which, if you spend a lot of money on something, it can be frustrated if you don't feel called to wearing it every single day. But I do wear it quite regularly. I use it in my grids a lot of times, and. I feel like very strongly that this is a very magical shape and a very magical material and a very magical necklace. So shout out to Dr. Patrick Flanagan. Uh, he's invented quite a few different things we will be discussing in this series, but this is the first one I want to talk about because it is the first one that I have uh, gotten of his. So uh, that is the Sensor 5. This is not a pyramid scam. I don't get any money from selling it. <laughs> and if you want to buy it, uh, sometimes you can find them used on eBay. These things are highly cultivated. People don't let them go very often. You can even get these on Amazon, but search around. The prices do vary quite a bit. Sometimes you'll find them on sale. Sometimes you'll find them used. And if you really want to manifest one, I believe you can. Uh, otherwise, you might want to look into maybe 3D printing it at least to start. Just really experience that shape because it's quite a unique uh, layout. It's quite a unique design and it entrances me every time I look at it. Thank you for joining me for Can This Heal Me? You need bless.